You know, I find athletes and people in life always make excuses. And you've got to just say when you play badly, I played badly, he played better than me. And that's exactly what the United States did. They just played better. And really on paper, on paper there's very little difference. I mean, if you look at the best swings in the world today, Adam Scott, you take Jason Day, you take Charles Watchell and Louis Oersthuizen. Basically, theoretically, those are probably the four best swings for perfection in the world today. So the difference is when you play 18-hole match play, anybody can win. But I don't know what it is. I can't answer it. I feel now the United States has lost continuously in the Ryder Cup to Britain. But I feel if our team is better than the Ryder Cup team in Europe, it just doesn't work out. I, I don't know what the answer is. All you've got to say is they played better. I think that has a lot to do with it, and it's a, it's a natural thing when people are screaming, USA, USA. Now, I said to my wife, I was pleased to be able to do this interview because I'd like to introduce something new for the President's Cup, and I hope captains in the future will adhere to this. We got to get the public to say, we are the world. We are the world. You can't just sit there and say nothing. You've got to retaliate. USA, great. We are the world, great. Because, I mean, after all, it is a match that people want to win but it's played in the true spirit of the game. If anybody can do it, it's Tiger Woods. But he definitely is not the same golfer he was when he was on that high roll. And it's understandable because he's been to coaches and they've taught him different things all the time. So he's only now getting into where he's getting the true muscle memory. But I personally see a few things in his swing that I believe, in my humble opinion, that he's doing wrong. And I think if he makes a slight change in his swing, in my humble opinion, he will definitely go past Nicholas because he's got at least, I would say, as long as he stays healthy and his knee doesn't give in, he's got another 40 majors. Most talented man? Yes, I, I think he will. But there are ifs. There are always ifs. And one can never take anything for granted and know what's in store for you in the future. But Tiger, you've got to take your hat off to him. Even with these problems he had in chopping and changing his swings with coaches, Still number one this year. I admire that tremendously. Well, when my son first spoke to me about uh, being in the nude, I said, no, I said, this is not for me. I thought this was some kook idea. But they did it very discreetly, and they do it from the side, so obviously nothing is seen. It's like being in a swimsuit, really. And I had more tweets and more emails and more telephone calls from people all over the world saying, you know, you're nearly 80, and I see the condition you're in. And I'm 45 and I'm 50 and I'm 50 pounds overweight and my children are fat. I promise you I'm going to now exercise. I'm going to get my kids on a proper diet. And that's my mission is to try and, you know, try and get people into condition.